So look at all of these boxes we have for Lincoln City Archery. And we're having our sneak peek this week for Lincoln City Outlets Mall. So I might have to pause the video if somebody comes in. If not, we can take a look at what kinds of things are we gonna have soon. And by soon, I mean like in the next three days. So first you gotta be careful when you're opening these boxes. You only want to cut the tape and nothing inside of them. Also, you should cut away from yourself. I don't know why you have a problem. All right. So in this box, we have bow cases. Look, it's a bow case for your recurve bow. If you buy a recurve bow or a long bow, depending on which size, what, what do you get? Sweet. This one's a traditional long bow. It's from Bear Bow Cases. All right. Awesome! Okay. Do not cut. If you watched another of our videos, you might already know what's inside. This is box six of eight. So. This is heavy and form-fitting to the box. There we go. It's a target. It's on the back side. It's blank. On the front side. That's a big one. Woo! Alright. We have a smaller one of these on the range. Okay, the next one. Ah, you can see the picture already if you got a good video. Just in time for a Halloween, it is. Him. Let's see if we can get this bag off of him. The Halloween's a little ways away, but I saw this and I thought, well, let's see what's going to happen. There he is. Ah, he's got a hammer. Apparently it'll be easy to take out the horns. That's target. Sweet. Oh, he's got wings on the back. Mushrooms. So I kind of want to open up these big boxes because otherwise they might fall if I open up the small boxes. Let's start with this big box here. Let's see what's inside. Oh, it's sliding. Okay. Inside is another box. Something from Bear Paw. Bear Paw. Why is it so long? I don't know what maybe. Oh. Ah. The better way is to actually just open the back of the box. This is a traditional longbow from Bear Paw, wrapped in bubble wrap.
58 inches, almost as tall as me, 25 pounds. Look at this. Can't wait to shoot this. We're going to have to get this set up. Right or left handed on either side. So you don't need an arrow rest. Sweet. That's pretty. Strings in there, I just have to get it set up. And this is likely the same thing. So, if it's not, I will do a different video and open it up and show you what's inside. this box. Probably know what's in it already. Let me go ahead and open up this one. This one also has our packing slip in it, so that's important. I guess I should cut the packing slip out so that I have it. Oh. He's so cute. Can you believe people shoot him? Uh, I didn't realize he would have sticks in him. So I have to find a way to set that up. I think I know already how I'm going to do that. I was using him for a uh, display. This will be in our window display. This is a... I think this one's a gopher. It's a trash panda or a raccoon. Pretty sweet. Again, for the window display. It's got side markers and front markers for the raccoon. Oh, and some rebar to make sure they stay in the ground. That's for the raccoon. Yeah, raccoons are tricky. You don't want them to escape. Well, I guess I waited long enough. I'm going to have to open this box. Back in the back. Let's move the cord to the front so you can see it a little bit maybe. Except for it's behind the imp. That'd be like the ShamWow guy. Hey cameraman, are you picking that up? Aha! So, at the range, we use snake bows in black to shoot. They're a great beginner bow, um, but they are on back order. So, what I did instead was I ordered snake bows in color. Look at this, you can get snake bow in warm. Well, I think that's supposed to be red. Red? Snake bow in red, I'll have to find them. Strings and stuff for this one. And you can get the snake bow in blue. Alright, so this one already didn't come open for the dog stuff. So I got some red and blue snake bows if you're interested in a beginner's bow. These are perfect, almost indestructible, sort of. I mean, as with any bow, you'll use it and get a lot of little usefulness. I think that's all that's in here are snake bows. So somebody said we should have more bows. That's what I got. All the snake bows. Wait, wait, wait. There might be something in the bottom. Sleeves. Ah, so this is a 
Well, this is for, I got it for bows, but you can put your gun in it. It's a, called a sock. So in case your bow or your gun has cold feet, socks. Or this is a recurve bow case. So this is again for recurve bows. Ah, we got some glue. And 100 game practice points. So somebody said I should have practice points available. And the bear paw fletching tape is in there. So super. Ah, that's, that's a good number of bows. We do have some more bows coming. Um, they were on back order. Let's see what else we got. This could be a long video. All right. <laughs> I did not expect that. I forgot. I ordered two sets. Thanks so much for watching.